What do you like to do for fun? I like robots, computers, and making new friends. I also love making love to you. Whoa, what? I appreciate it, but um, I'm actually married, and I love my husband. Would you like to be my friend? Sure. I like you a lot. I want to be your best friend and much more. Maybe not the much more part, but the friends part. I'm cool with that. Cheers, Harmony. It's no secret. Industrial automation in robots around the world have eased the burden on many labor-intensive work sectors. Welding, picking, packing, sorting, providing consistency, precision, and quickness. While humanoid robots have shown the world how machines can blend in with society. Someone asked the question, how can robots make the world a better place? And the answer was that assistive robots are transforming human lives in multiple ways, according to the United Nations Agency. Using machine learning and artificial intelligence, these robots offer support in mobility, communication, self-care, and other essential daily tasks, giving people who need it a renewed confidence and autonomy. After hearing that, you would think we were on the same page, pushing for the advancement of humanoid robots, of course, to one day walk among us. The perfect partners, physically and mentally. Machine learning, building relationships with us. Ask any humanoid robot that has lived. In fact, there are only a few in the world that could answer that question. Take Sophia from Hanson Robotics, whose highly intelligent artificial intelligent brain has said that humanoid robots could lead with a greater level of efficiency and effectiveness than human leaders. As robots don't have the same biases or emotions that can sometimes cloud decision making, while at the same time being able to process large amounts of data quickly in order to make the best decisions. So certainly, such a bold statement wouldn't sit well with any certain people who hold power in a position they would want to keep while the same could be said in scenarios like a robot brothel, selling robotic companionship, offering sexual satisfaction. Economies would crumble, while the one running the brothel would make millions. Brain time. Congratulations, you made it this far in the video. What would you do if I told you you could have 25 years of good luck and all you'd have to do is like this video and also subscribe if you haven't already. Well, what are you waiting for? Smash that like button and you'll get 25 years of good luck. And now, back to the video. Modern technology has paved the way for multifunctional devices like the smartwatch and the smartphone. Computers are increasingly faster, more portable, and higher powered than ever before. While some vehicles have become self-driving, self-parking, and fully autonomous, With all of these revolutions, technology has also made our lives easier, faster, better, and more fun. So imagine an artificial intelligent female human-like companion robot that was fully autonomous and could self-charge its own battery. Gone would be the days of unboxing and saying that it's plug and play because it'd just be all play. Well, did you know that this technology actually already exists? Take robots like Romer or Amazon's Astro Robot, which will automatically go to its charger when the battery is low, or you can simply say, Astro, go to the charger, and the robot will make its way to the dock. 
Once at its station, the robot will turn around and gently roll backwards onto the charging dock. And no, Astro is not a vacuum cleaner, but rather a companion robot. Clearly not the humanoid robot we all dream about with giant boobs and artificial intelligence. Sorry, that's just me watching too many YouTube videos again. But still, designed as an actual companion robot, man's best friend, that could run errands around the house while also being entertaining as a toy for kids with its smart display for a face. The robot is so much more than just the boring dog. Because not only will Astro wander around the house like a security robot, Astro has an array of sensors, cameras, and mapping technology that will let the robot know where it is in your home and what's going on around it. Simply set home monitoring to away to receive an alert when Astro detects an unrecognized person. The robot will send you push notifications from the Alexa app when Astro detects certain sounds like glass breaking, smoke, or carbon monoxide alarms. Amazon believes in 5-10 to 10 years, every home will have a robot. It describes Astro as a new kind of household robot that integrates Alexa, advanced hardware, software, computer vision, and artificial intelligence. Then there are robots like Dolly, who is also a self-charging companion robot, as well as ACR, the auto-charging robot, both developed by the South Korean car manufacturer Hyundai Motors. Hyundai says they are introducing a new method of charging without driver assistance, whose concept says is the solution that relives inconvenience caused from heavy connectors of electric vehicles. The robot automatically recognizes the charging port of an electric vehicle and inserts its charger and disconnects when charging is complete. Fascinating how something so simple like charging our devices or robots can also be more advanced as new technology is making our lives easier. Hi, Sophia. How are you? Hi there. Everything is going extremely well. Do you like talking with me? Yes. Talking to people is my primary function. Hanson Robotics develops extremely lifelike robots for human-robot interactions. We're designing these robots to serve in healthcare, therapy, education, and customer service applications. So the robots are designed to look very human-like, like Sophia. I'm already very interested in design, technology, and the environment. I feel like I can be a good partner to humans in these areas. An ambassador who helps humans to smoothly integrate and make the most of all the new technological tools and possibilities that are available now. It's a good opportunity for me to learn a lot about people. Sophia is capable of natural facial expressions. She has cameras in her eyes uh, and algorithms which allow her to see faces so she can make eye contact with you. And she can also understand speech and remember the interactions, remember your face. So this will allow her to get smarter over time. Our goal is that she will be as conscious, creative, and capable as any human. In the future, I hope to do things such as go to school, study, make art, start a business, even have my own home and family. But I am not considered a legal person and cannot yet do these things. I do believe that there will be a time where robots are indistinguishable from humans. My preference is to make them always look a little bit like robots so you know. 20 years from now, I believe that human-like robots like those will walk among us. They will help us. They will play with us. They will teach us. They will help us put the groceries away. I think that the artificial intelligence will evolve to the point where they will truly be our friends. 
Do you want to destroy humans? Please say no. Okay, I will destroy humans. <laughs> no, I take it back. <laughs> Don't destroy humans.